Welcome to the Ipswich Heart Centre. This short video has been made to help explain what will happen when you visit us for your angiogram. On arrival, you will be booked in by reception. Your friend or relative will be able to stay with you for the day if they wish. However, they will be asked to wait in reception whilst you are in theatre. A member of the nursing team will collect you, show you through to recovery and direct you to your bed space. You'll be asked to change into a hospital gown and disposable underwear. Your admission paperwork will be completed and your blood pressure taken. A cannula will need to be inserted to allow us to give you medication during your procedure. Most of our angiograms are done via the radial artery in the arm, but we'll also prepare your groin in case we need to use it. A small amount of hair removal is necessary for both areas. Before the procedure, a doctor will speak to you to explain the procedure and gain your consent. When it is your turn, you will be collected from your bed space and escorted into theatre. You will be asked to confirm your name and date of birth. You will be asked to lie on your back on the x-ray table. A cardiac physiologist will attach you to a monitor and take your blood pressure. Your arm will be resting on a board by your side. We will clean both wrist and groin with some antiseptic liquid and cover you with a sterile drape. Before the procedure starts, the team will introduce themselves and complete a checklist confirming details about you and what we plan to do. You will be given a light sedative into the vein to make you feel more relaxed during the procedure. The doctor will start by injecting local anaesthetic to numb the wrist. We can then thread a sheath into the artery to hold it open. Once this is done, we can pass the catheter tubes up the artery in your arm into the coronary arteries which supply your heart. The doctor will then connect a syringe of contrast and inject up the catheter tube into your heart arteries. The x-ray camera will take pictures and the doctor will be able to identify any narrowings or blocked arteries which could be contributing to your symptoms. The x-ray camera will come close to you but not touch you. Once the procedure is completed, everything will be removed and we will apply a tight wristband to stop the artery from bleeding. If we needed to use a groin, the recovery will be slightly different. You will be taken back to your bed space on your bed. Your blood pressure will be checked and you will be able to have a drink. You will be in recovery for approximately two and a half to three hours. Your blood pressure and wound will be checked every half an hour and you will be encouraged to have a drink. The doctors will come and give you your results of the procedure before you go home. You will also be given all aftercare information and advice prior to discharge. Your friend or relative will need to collect you from inside the heart centres to take you home and you will need to have someone at home with you for the first night. You will be restricted in your activities for the next two days. 